volume of pyramids and cones. Now you'll notice that this formula here says volume is one third times area times height. Okay, now what I want you to do is I want you to think back to prisms. Here's a prism here, a square base prism, and its volume is area times height. And here we have a pyramid. Now this pyramid has the same base. It's got a square, the same size as this prism here, and the pyramid is also the same height as this prism. And you'll notice that its volume is one third of area times height. And the reason for that is a pyramid is one third the size of the prism. All right, and I've actually got a, a link here that you can look at. It's a really good video someone has made. And they show that it takes three pyramids of liquid to fill up the prism. 